This problem is asking us to find the area of the parallelogram below. There are two formulas for the area of a parallelogram. The first is base times height. However, in this problem, we're given values for neither base nor height. The second formula for the area of a parallelogram is one-half times the product of its diagonals, or one-half times diagonal one times diagonal two. When I look at this problem, I have values for both diagonal one and diagonal two. So I can use substitution and substitute those values in to the equation to create a new equation, which is one-half times sixteen times thirteen. Multiply that out to get one-half of two hundred and eight or one hundred and four. So the area of this parallelogram is one hundred and four.